In this video, we're going to review how to see my design, my bridge design with OpenBridge Modeler into Google Earth. In this particular file, I already have the bridge modeled with OpenBridge Modeler in a raster image as a reference. I also have the aerial map or the location. Right. And as a DTM as well, I just uh, modify using the override symbology, modify its display. Okay, so now I'm ready to see my entire design in Google Earth. For that, as you can see, the coordinates being displayed for my design are in XYZ format. So what I need to find out is what are the corresponding geometric location or geography location of this particular design file. For that, we go to Tools, Geography. I will open this as a toolbox. So we have all the options available. So what I need to do first is associate this DGN file with the proper co geographic system, geographic coordinate system. This could be in your local agency. This happens to be that this project is in Florida and this was the coordinate system used for this. Uh, how to attach one? So you can go from the library as Bentley provide a library of all these coordinates or geographic coordinates and it happens to be that this particular file needs to be associated with the North America Florida and is the EPSG 2236 right so I can attach this I'll make it to my favorites, as you can see at the top. So, and that just, it's EPSG 2236, right here. Right? So, when I go right click, I can add it to the favorites. Uh, this is the transformation that is used to get to that geographic system. So as I said, these have to be, could be retrieved by your local agency tell you what's the coordinate system to use. So saying that, we can double click and attach it. So now this file is associated with the proper coordinate system. It's also as part, it becomes part of your auxiliary coordinates. So you wanna make it active. You can just double click on that and see this and then even though this is still displaying X, Y coordinates, if you do right, uh, left click, you can see the coordinate position that is in my geographic system. And then you can see now the same coordinates and make it active here. And the same coordinates, you can see it now in this view, look, in Lat and long, latitude and longitude. So you want to come back to normal, you can just say, just use the regular position and that will do it. So now this file is already associated then to that geographic coordinate system. So the next step is as simple as export that view to Google Earth. So what is it going to do, as I left click, it's going to create a KMS file. So Google Earth can read it, I just save it. And if I have Google Earth in my computer, as I have it right now, it will launch automatically Google Earth on display my bridge.
also here as you can see it's bringing not only the design but any display levels reference files that it was attached at the moment of that uh, sending to google and as you can see that is the bridge now all display in google Earth. so i can go also and here i can specify that i don't want to see certain elements like the reference files that were attached i only interested for example on the bridge on a particular level right uh, and then i don't want to see the dtm or the terrain that was associated to it as well it was on the file I just only want to see the bridge itself and now I can just see my bridge I can see my bridge then in Google Earth and that's how you do it thank you